Hello, hello. Welcome back. Welcome back. How's everybody doing today? Welcome, welcome. Hello, Cesar. Hello, Carlos. Good night, teacher. Good evening, good evening. Hello, Iris. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, good evening Freddy. Good evening, Melissa. Hello, teacher. Good evening, Mayra. Good evening, good evening. Miguel. Good evening, David. Welcome, welcome. How are you good today? Evening. Fine, thanks for asking. What about you? Very good, very good. Are you ready for your English class? Of course. Yes, I'm ready. All right, awesome, awesome. Can anybody tell me what you remember from yesterday's class? Yesterday we were practicing a conversation about um, Describing a city. That is correct. That is correct. Uh, can you tell me a little bit about your favorite city, David? About the city that I did with my couple. That is correct. Okay. Um, let me tell you. Mm -hmm. um, we were describing the, the city of San Salvador. Um, Liz asked me where, I am, where am I from, mm -hmm. and I said I am from El Salvador, San Salvador, and we went, we started to describe in the city. It's a fairly big city, huh. and it has uh, several parks that I can practice sports, and something like this. Okay, okay. Very good. Excellent. Perfect. So today, I would like for us to move forward, and we're going to be looking at the next section, which is coming from the platform. I would like for us to look at this section right here. Has everybody completed section number 1.7, knowledge check? Instructions, read the sentences and choose the correct conjunction. Instrucciones, lea las oraciones y escoja la mejor opción donde se ocupe la conjugación correcta. Taipei is very nice. Everyone is extremely friendly. And then we have and and but. Who can do number one, please? Ya hicieron esta actividad todos? Yes, teacher. Yes, yes, teacher. Okay. ¿Quién me puede dar la respuesta para la número uno? One volunteer, one volunteer, one volunteer, one volunteer. Oh, Carlos, excellent, Carlos, thank you. Okay, Carlos, number one, please. This type is very nice. Hey, everyone is extremely funny. Excellent. Taipei is very nice. And everyone is extremely friendly. Perfect, Carlos, thank you. Number two, Myra. Okay, the streets are crowded. It's easy to get around south. Very good. The streets, the streets are crowded and it's easy to get around. Excellent. Uh, the streets are crowded. It's easy to get around though. W which one is your answer? The first one or the second one? Second one. Second one, correct. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Okay, thank you, Myra. Number three, please. 
C'est ça, Alexandre. Yes, teacher. Uh, good evening. Number hey, three. Good evening, Cesar. How are you? Fine. Thank you, teacher. Excellent. Number three. The weather is, is nice. Summer get, get pretty hot and on forever. Very good. That is correct. The weather is nice. Number two. Seria. Yes, the weather is nice and summer gets pretty hot. Good. Thank you, Cesar. Let me have number four. Luisa. Shopping is great and you have uh, and you have to bargain in the market. Okay. So we say shopping is great, but you have to bargain in the markets. Good. Do you know what is the meaning bargain? Do you know what Tanta. the meaning? Uh -huh. Bargain is como regatear, right? Quiero cinco, le doy tres. Cuatro, le doy tres cincuenta. Okay. Bargain. And number five, the last one, Catherine, Jasmine. Um, number one, the food is delicious, but it's not too expensive. All right, the food is delicious. And it's not too and, expensive. Yeah, and I'm sorry. it's not too expensive. That's okay. All right, good, good. Perfect. Good job, guys. Oh, look at this one. The weather is nice. Summer gets pretty hot, however. Okay. Yeah, because in this case, I think both would be acceptable. On this one, I think both would be acceptable. All right. Did everybody finish this activity? Any questions at this moment? No, sure. Any questions at this moment on this activity? Somebody? Questions. No. Anybody? You got it? Okay. We're going to go ahead and take a look at introduced in a conversation using can and should. Can and should. Uh, can is poder. Por ejemplo, tú dices, yo puedo manejar, I can drive. Eh, si tú dices, yo puedo eh, nadar, I can swim. I can swim. I can swim. Eh, puedo tocar la guitarra, I can play, play guitar. All right. Puedo cocinar. I can cook. All right. So, el can es más para expresar una habilidad, algo que tú puedes hacer. El should es para hacer, para expresar lo que deberías de hacer. Por ejemplo, tú dices, yo debería hacer una dieta. I should go on a diet. Pero las 10 de la noche y estoy buscando galletas con leche. I should go on a diet. <laughs> Escondiendo las galletas de mí mismo. I should go on a diet. Uh, otra cosa. Mm, debería de hacer más ejercicio. I should exercise. I should exercise. Eh, Debería ahorrar. I should say. Right? Or I should study. Debería estudiar. Right? Es como para un consejo. 
Repeat, I can drive. Repeat, I can drive. I can drive. I can swim. I can I can swim. I can cook. I can I can cook. I can play the guitar. I can play the guitar. I can, okay, I should go on a diet. I should, I should go, go on a diet. I should save. I should save. Okay, repeat after me. What can you do? What, what can you do? do? ¿Qué puedes hacer? What should you do? What, 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 what should, should, should you do? ¿Qué deberías hacer? Repeat, what can you do? What can you do? What can you do? What should you do? What, what should, 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 should you do? do? Okay, some, uh, let me have one volunteer. One volunteer. Teacher. Yes? Who? One volunteer. Me. Okay, me. Can you hear me? Myra. Yes. All right. Myra, ask Mr. Santos the question. Repeat, please. Ask Mr. Santos the question. Pregúnteme las. La primera, what can you do? Why can you do? Uh, I can drive. I can swim. I can't play guitar. I can't cook. I can speak English. Okay, Maida, what yes. can you do? I can cook. I can read. Drive. I, drive. I can drive. No, I can read. Oh, read, read. Okay, I read. can read, read. Okay. I can drive. Mm -hmm. I can type. Okay. I can speak English. Okay. I can play the guitar. Okay. All right, excellent. All right. The next one, uh, ask me the next question. What should you do? What should you do? I should eat less. I should diet. I should exercise more. I should read more. I should pray more. I should visit my family more. Okay, thank you. Myra, what should you do? I should read more. I should, I should study more I study English more mm -hmm. um, I should exercise mm -hmm. I should eat more vegetables mm -hmm. I should uh, go to visit my parents more mm -hmm. That's all. Okay, good job. Uh, go ahead, select somebody, Myra. Uh, Luisa Ariana. Okay, Luis Ariana. Luisa Ariana. Usted va a hacer la primera pregunta. César Alexander va a responder. Okay. What can you do? 
I can drive a car and I can swim. I, I can sing only. Okay. Now you ask the questions. Yes. Uh, what can you do? I can swim. I can cook. Uh, I can't drive. Um, I can't play guitar. Only. Okay. Now ask the next question. What should you do? I should go on a diet. I should exercise exercise more. And should uh, sleep more. Excellent. What what should you do? I should go on a diet. I should exercise. I should save. I should visit my family more. Only. Okay, good job. Very good. Thank you, teacher. Excellent. Okay, now Cesar, select somebody. Okay. One person or two person? Only one. Luisa Ariana is going to select the other person. Okay, uh, okay. Uh, sería Melissa Guadalupe. Melissa Guadalupe? Can you hear Glendy, me? Glendy Elisette. Glendy Elisette, can you hear me? Hello, hello. Melissa Guadalupe, Glendy Elisette. Okay, Glendy Elisette, ask the question. Melissa Guadalupe, respond. Okay, uh, what can you do? Melissa? Hello, hello, Melissa Guadalupe. Okay, uh, select somebody else. I think she's working. Select somebody Ricardo else. Fabricio. Okay, Ricardo Fabricio. Hello, good night. Ricardo. Hello, good evening. What, what can you do? Mm, I can ride, I can swim. I can cook and only, only you. So let's. Okay. So let's, mm -hmm. Okay, now vice versa. Ricardo asked the question, Glendy respond. What should, what should you do? I should do exercise. I should read more. I should visit my grandfather more. I should learn to drive. And I should uh, learn to cook more. Excellent. Now, Glendy, ask the question. What should you do? Um, I'll, I'll show you, I'll show, I'll show exercise. Um, I'll show going at, on a ride. Um, I'll show the study. Study um, or study? I study, study, uh -huh. study, sorry. study, sorry. study, study. <laughs> okay, okay. 
<laughs> okay. Okay. Good job, guys. Um, at this moment, does anybody have any questions in regards to this activity? Okay. Let's go ahead and check out what should I see there. Everybody, please listen to the audio. Hi, I want you to listen to this conversation and try to identify the modal verbs which are being introduced in this audio program. Also, it is recommended for you to practice this conversation with someone else. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Sure I can. What would you like to know? Well, what's a good time to visit? I think you can go anytime. The weather is always nice. Oh, good. And what should I see there? Well, you should definitely visit the National Museum and go to the Palace of Fine Arts. And what else? Oh, you shouldn't miss the Pyramid of the Sun. It's very interesting. It all sounds really exciting. One more time. Hi, I want you to listen to this conversation and try to identify the modal verbs which are being introduced in this audio program. Also, it is recommended for you to practice this conversation with someone else. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Sure I can. What would you like to know? Well, what's a good time to visit? I think you can go anytime. The weather is always nice. Oh, good. And what should I see there? Well, you should definitely visit the National Museum and go to the Palace of Fine Arts. And what else? Oh, you shouldn't miss the Pyramid of the Sun. It's very interesting. It all sounds really exciting. Okay, at this moment, does anybody have any questions about the pronunciation or about the meaning of any of these words? Questions about the pronunciation or the meaning of any of these words? Nobody? Any questions? Not, not no? for me, teacher. Okay. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to practice the conversation. Listen and repeat. Listen and repeat. Can you tell me a little bit about Mexico City? Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Sure, I can. What would you like to know? Sure, I can. Well, like, no. well, what's a good time to visit? Well, what I would like to visit? I think you can go anytime. The weather is always nice. I think, I think you can, can go anytime. The weather is always nice. Oh, good. And what should I see there? Oh, good. Oh, good. 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 I showed I see there. Well, you should definitely visit the National Museum and go to the Palace of Fine Arts. Well, you yeah, should definitely you should visit definitely the National Museum and what else? And what else? And what else? What else? Oh, you should, you should, shouldn't, you shouldn't, you, you shouldn't, shouldn't. miss. Should. The pyramid Please. of the sun. Oh, it's yes. very the interesting. Of the sun. Oh, oh, you shouldn't miss the pyramid of the, the sun. Very very it's very interesting. 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 It's very interesting. It all sounds really interesting. It all it sounds all really sound exciting. Really exciting. Really exciting. Really interesting. Ah no, exciting, exciting. It's I can't annoying. I can't see that. Really clear. exciting. <laughs> all right. Uh, at this moment, does anybody have any questions 
about the pronunciation, uh, questions about the meaning of the words or anything like that? Okay, let me have two volunteers. <clears throat> me, teacher. Okay, Cesar. And I'm, Miguel. Teacher. Okay, Miguel and Cesar. Miguel, you are going to be Tomas. Cesar, you're going to be <laughs> Elena. Okay. Can you tell me a little, a little about Museum City? Sure, I can. Mexico City. Sorry. Sure, I can. What? Wood. What you like to know? Well, what's a good time to visit? I I think you can go to go anytime. The theater are were nice. Oh, good. And what should I see there? Well, you should definitely in the National Museum and they go to the palace. Earth. And what else? Oh, you shouldn't visit the pyramid pyramid on the on the song. It's very interesting. It all sounds really exciting. That's it. Very good. Good job. You. Excellent, Cesar. Excellent, Miguel. All right. Okay, go ahead. Select somebody, Cesar. Select somebody, Miguel. Uh, Carlos William. Carlos William, you're going to be Thomas. Who? Hiroki. Hiroki, you are going to be Elena. Okay. Action. Can Carlos and Hiroki. Action. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Okay, let's select another person. I think Hiroki is working. Okay. Jonathan? Jonathan, you are Elena. You can tell me a little about Mexico City. Solo que no tengo la conversación. Eh, la, como, la compartí en el grupo de WhatsApp. Ah, ok. Eh, Elena, ok. Ready. Action. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Sure, I can. What would you like to know? Well, what good time to visit? I think you can go any any time. The the weather is always nice. Oh, good! In what and I see here. Mm -hmm. Well, you should de definitely visit the national museum and go to the pala palace of arts in Walsy. Oh, you show uh, the pyramids of the sun? It's very interesting. It's, it also really excellent. Exciting. Okay. Exciting. Exciting. Good. Okay, guys. Uh, at this moment, before we continue, I'm going to go ahead and take the attendance. So when I call your name, I would like for everybody to please say present. 
Okay, Adriana Gonzalez. Here. Okay, Adriana Gonzalez present. Andrea Alvarez. Andrea. Uh, I can't. Hello? I can't. See the conversation. Oh, okay. Uh, is your name Andrea Alvarez? Yes. Okay, thank you. Carlos Valdez. Carlos Valdez. Yes, teacher. Present. I present. Cesar Lopez. Present teacher. Present. Christian Torres. Present. Present. Claudia Rivas. Present. Present. Uh, David Mejia. Present. Freddy Alvarez. Glendy Flores. Present. Iris Martinez. Present teacher. Irving Hiroki. Jonathan Salinas. I'm here. Josue Portillo. I'm here. Carla Villanueva. Yes, Catherine Guatemala. Present. Lisbeth. Martinez. Present teacher. Luisa Guerra. Present. Luz Perez. Luz Perez. Absent. Paira Patricia. Present. Melissa Mendez. Present teacher, no sé si me escucha. Eh, Melissa Mendez. Sí. Yes, present. Thank you. Okay. Ner Nerlin Flores. Present teacher. All right. Ricardo Diaz. I hear a teacher. All right. Yancy Yamilet. Yancy Yamilet. Okay. All right. Now, what I would like for us to do is we're going to work in pairs. Vamos a trabajar en parejas. And we are going to practice the conversation. Vamos a practicar la conversación. Speaking and pronunciation practice. Teacher, tiene, no, no teacher. sé si tiene la, la imagen de mejor calidad porque sí cuesta leerla. Uh, solo dele play y trate de escuchar la palabra. That's the only copy that I have. Ok.
Eh, primero. Hola. Hola, hola. Eh, y el otro compañero no escucha. No está hola. conectado. Eh, who is the first? Hola, ¿le escucho? Hola. Hello. Hola. Sí, este, ¿alguien la puede compartir la, la, la imagen? En el grupo la mandaron ya. En WhatsApp. Ok. Yeah. Ah, entonces, ¿quién va a ser? Casi no se sé ve, ¿no? pero ¿quién va a ser Tomás? Eh, bueno, voy a comenzar yo entonces. Perfecto, de ahí le sigo. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Sure, I can. What would you like uh, to know? Well, what's a good time to visit? I think you, I think you can go anytime. The weather is always nice. Oh, good. And uh, what should... I see there. Well, you should definitely visit the National mu Museum and go to the Palace of Fidart, algo así, está como que no se nota. Eh. And what else? Oh, you... You shouldn't miss the pyramid of the sun. It's very interesting. It all sounds really exciting. Creo que eso era, ¿verdad? Sí. Ah, ya lo hallé, lo, lo hallé en otra parte. Eh, en la del libro se ve mejor, no lo había hallado. No sé si lo van a repasar. Eh, sí, no sé si el compañero quiere hacerlo también. Excelente. Yo soy Tomás. Can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Sure. I can. I can. What would you like to know? Well, what a good time to visit. I think you can go anytime. The weather is always nice. Oh, good. And what sort in city? Well, you should definitely visit the National Museum and go to the Palace of Five Arts. And what else? Oh, you shouldn't miss the pyramid of the sun. It's very interesting. He it, it told sounds really exciting. No sé si se si lo vamos a ir practicando.
All right, let me have two volunteers, please. Two volunteers. Let me have two volunteers. Two volunteers. Meeting chair. All right, Cesar. Another volunteer. Me. Okay, Myra. Cesar, you are going to be uh, Elena. Myra is going to be Thomas. Okay. Uh, can you tell me a little about Mexico City? Uh, Cesar, your microphone is in silence. Excuse me. Okay. Sure can. Sure can. What would you like to know? You know. Well, what's a good time to visit? I think you can go anytime. The weather is or what night. Oh, good. And what should I see there? Well, you should de definitely visit the National Museum and the, go to the Palace of Fine Arts. And what else? Oh, you shouldn't miss the Pyramid of the Sun. It's very interesting. It all sounds really exciting. Perfect, perfect. Uh, Cesar, select somebody. Mayra, select somebody. Okay. Uh, Melissa Guadalupe. Melissa Guadalupe is going to be. Uh, Thomas Iris Janet is going to be Elena. Okay. Um, can you tell me a little about Mexico City? How do I perdón. Uh, sure, I can. What word would you like to know? Well, that a good time to visit it. I think you can go. I think you can go anything. The weather is always nice. Oh, good. And why salt is it there? Well, you should definitely. Visit the National Museum and go to the Palace of Fine Arts. And what else? Oh, you sure? Me. What else? What else? What else? What else? Oh, you sure miss the pyramid? Pyramid? Pyramid. 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 Pyramid of the sun is very interesting. It all sounds really exciting. 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 Mm -hmm. exciting. exciting. Okay. Now, for this activity, guys, you are going to write a similar conversation by escribir una conversación similar a esta over here in the discussion box. That's going to be your homework. Any questions? Teacher, I have a question. You can hear me? Yes, definitely. Yes. I can hear you. Teacher? Definitely, I can hear you. Okay, so when I you uh, as attendance, I am speaking, but I think do you don't uh, hear me? Okay. Because I had a little problem with my microphone. Oh, let me check. Give me yeah. one moment. And this one is. <clears throat> Give me one second. This one is.
Okay, here it is. And what is your name? Freddy Jose. Freddy Alvarez. Yep. Okay. Okay, there it is, presence. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Thank you so much. I got your present. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Any questions about this activity? Not for me. All right. I have I have a question, teacher. Yes, Carla Tatiana. Uh, okay. Uh, what's the pronunciation definitely? Uh, I, I say and show. I write the, the, the words in the chat. And yes. what what they mean uh, the second words, please, mm -hmm. in, of in Spanish. Oh, okay. Uh, repeat, please. Definitely. Therefore. Definitely. Therefore. Definitely. Everybody. Definitely. 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 Right. That definitely. means definitivamente. Uh, repeat. Shouldn't. 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 Uh, Shouldn't. Se, utiliza, Shouldn't. se utiliza para decir algo que no deberías hacer. For example, to this, yo digo a mí mismo. Eh, mí mismo, I shouldn't eat cookies at night. Right? No debería comer galletas en la noche. And I okay. always eat cookies at night. Okay. Or for That's example, or for example, to this says, no debería desvelarme. I shouldn't stay up late. Yes. O para la gente que fuma, uh, no deberías fumar. You shouldn't smoke. Y el should es el contrario. ¿Qué deberías hacer? Por ejemplo, yo digo, yo debería ahorrar más. I should save more. O yo debería leer la Biblia más. I should read the Bible more. Mm -hmm. So es como que el que debería o no debería hacer. Good question. Thank you. Uh, David Alonso dice, I should, yo debería, I shouldn't, yo no debería. Very good. Correct, David Alonso. Thank you. Eh, Adriana, veo que tiene pregunta. Thank you, Carla, for your question. Sí, hola, este, o sea que el should es como un mandato mm -hmm. o como una recomendación la que se está dando. Correcto. Así sería como en conclusión. Correcto, como un consejo o ajá, un consejo de lo que debería de hacer o un consejo de lo que no debería de hacer. Pero no sería un mandato, o sea, un, como una obligación. No, es ahí sería más. Ajá, ah. es como una recomendación. Si es un mandato, okay. ya sería más. M-U-S-T, ah, okay. más. Ok, gracias. Sí. Another question. Another question. Okay. Now, what I would like for us to do is take a look at the next section, which is coming from here. Order to ask and answer questions. Modal verbs. In this session, modal verbs can and should will be thought in order to ask and answer questions. Those are called modal verbs. Model verbs show a speaker's attitude or mood. We can also use them to ask for and give advice. Stay with us as we will explain them. Modal verbs can and should. What can I do in Mexico City? You can see the Palace of Fine Arts. You can't visit some museums on Mondays. What should I see there? You should visit the National Museum. You shouldn't miss the Pyramid of the Sun. 
Okay, we'll talk about the modal verbs can and should. This is how we'll use it in a question. WH question word plus modal verb plus subject plus verb plus question mark. Where should we go? And this is how we use it in a positive sentence. Subject plus modal verb plus verb plus complement. We should go to a museum. This is how we use it in a negative sentence. Subject plus modal verb plus not plus verb plus complement. We shouldn't go to a museum. It is important to notice that models do not take a final S and neither does the main verb. He should go to a museum. Maria shouldn't drink. Did you notice? There's no change on should and neither on the main verb go. All right, does anybody have any questions in regards to how to use should and shouldn't? Preguntas en cómo usar should y shouldn't. David Alonso. Question? No, I don't have a question. Okay. Let's go and look at the following one. I want you to write five examples here in the discussion forum. I want you to give me five with should and five examples with shouldn't. Cinco ejemplos con should y cinco ejemplos con shouldn't. And I want you to write it right here in the discussion box. We don't shouldn't eat it during the class. Very good. We shouldn't eat during the class. Correct. We shouldn't. Good job. All right, so give me five examples and write it here in the discussion box. Los van a escribir acá en la caja de discusión. Any questions? All right, you will have five minutes to work with your group. Puede escribirlas y después pasarlas a la plataforma. in pairs. Creo que sí. Así sería, ¿verdad? ¿Cinco de qué? Cinco should. Y las otras eran de shouldn. ¿O no? Acuerdo, parece que sí. Sí, es cierto. Sí. Ok. Ok. Um, I should eat healthy. Se usa, lo ponemos aquí en el grupo. Ay, uh, perdón, en el mensaje, ¿cómo se llama? Sí. Okay. 
Hát ok, vậy mà Để không ham Sería, sería un corto ¿no? Sí Ok Yo hit, hit, ¿qué es eso? Hit, hit eh, comer. Ajá, como comer saludable. Ok. Eh, vamos con los shoulder. ¿Qué? ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Shouldn't. All right, guys, it's already time to go. I would like for you to please continue working on the platform. Don't stop working on the platform and we will move forward tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Good night, guys. Good night, everyone. See you. Good night, guys. Good night. See you. Good night, teacher. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night.